Good morning and welcome to the daily message. This morning, I would like to do a short reflection on part of the uh, Matthew's gospel that is proclaimed during this Lenten season. It's the one where Jesus is teaching his disciples by saying, ask and it will be given to you. Seek and you will find. Knock and the door will be opened. For whoever asks will receive. Whoever seeks will find. Whoever knocks, the door will be opened. What parent would give their child a rock when he asks for bread? How much more then will our Heavenly Father who loves us gives good gifts to those who ask. I'm sure this passage is very familiar to you. Jesus' exhortation of ask, seek, and knock in prayer sounds like a, a carte blanche promise that anything you or I ask for will be given to us. Maybe that's our 21st century mindset kicking in, instant gratification. Everything has to be now. We know from our experience in Christian living, that's not the way things work. Entering into a serious prayer sometimes can be very scary because we don't know the outcome. But we enter into this experience with faith and trust, knowing that our Heavenly Father will respond to us in a most loving way. We may sometimes question ourselves about our motives or our methods of prayer. Am I asking for the right thing? Am I doing something wrong in my asking? Am I worthy? I think what Jesus is saying to us is that when we feel a need so intensely that it drives us back to God over and over again, we need not be discouraged even if the answer is delayed. God does respond to our prayer in a most loving way. We need to keep praying with sincerity and persistence. That's our job. And we have to let him worry about his response, about when or what good gifts he has in store for us. Thank you for listening and have a good day.